many years now, my family has made a summer trip to Ocean City, Maryland. Over the years, we have discovered some really cool places and we continue to find something new every year. Whether you're visiting for the first time or it's your 10th time, I hope you find something new to check out in this video. Although we spend most days on the beach, we try to break it up by visiting nearby towns and doing some shopping. On our first day, we checked out the farmer's market in Berlin. There were lots of local vendors set up and musicians as well. We love visiting the shops and wandering around this cute little town. If you like boutique or antique stores, then you'll love Berlin. Maybe at the record store. You've bought tons of stuff. I haven't bought anything yet. But it's a very nice day out, so. Woohoo! I'm not too sweaty yet, which is good. Same. But we'll find out. After spending the morning in Berlin, we went straight to the beach on Assateague Island. Assateague is about 8 miles south of Ocean City and it's our favorite beach in the area. As you drive in, you'll see wild horses roaming the park. Just remember to keep your distance and appreciate the horses from afar. That evening, we stopped by the concert in Northside Park in OC. This event was much larger than we expected and it was great to see so many families enjoying the concert in the park. We went to Berlin, went to the farmer's market there, some antique stores, and then we went to the beach for a little bit and now we're at the park listening to some free music, and then we're gonna get some ice cream. But yeah, taking pictures. Attempting to. They don't say, serve any alcohol here. What is it, a family event? Sundays in the park is for families? Just get me a little bit of Malibu or rum and I'll put it in my Diet Coke. We ended our first night with ice cream sundaes at King Cone which I highly recommend over any other ice cream parlor in OC. So it was a little rainy in Ocean City today. So we took a drive down to Rehoboth Beach to do a little shopping, because there's a couple record stores we're gonna go to. So, and then we'll go to the beach now that the sun has come out a little bit and warms up. Right? Right. Right. Right, let's go. Let's go. We're just hanging out today. Doing a lot of shopping because it rained this morning. It rained this right. afternoon. And I don't. Oh, I bought one record today so far. I bought two. You and bought we're two. In Delaware. We are. We drove up from Ocean City, which was about an hour away. And I'm getting hungry. But the towns are cute that we're in, so that's helpful. And the sun came out, which kind of like, you know. Oh, yeah. oh. Sun comes out when you're not at the beach. But beach the rest of the week yep. for sure for sure for sure i'm done shopping i am done shopping too so unfortunately the weather the next day was not in our favor since it rained on and off we decided to take a long trip out to rehoboth beach in delaware i won't spend too much time sharing our day here since it's so far out of the way from oc but we did some shopping and checked out some record stores in the area something that i think ocean city lacks we grabbed dinner and drinks at the green turtle in west ocean city before calling it a night so because we got rained out today, we ended up doing a very, very big shopping day. We drove all the way from Ocean City to Rehoboth Beach 
to go to a couple record stores. They have an outlet store, outlet mall out that way. And I ended up buying a few things. So I'm gonna show you guys what I bought. So starting with this denim skirt that I got from American Eagle. Literally almost everything I got was on sale because that's how I shop. Um, but cute little denim skirt. And then from Aerie, I grabbed a pair of bike shorts. Casual, something to just hang out in. From South Moon Under, I got the prettiest dress. I'm obsessed with it. It is a long sleeve kind of wrap dress. And it looks way cuter on. It's hard to show without putting it on. I'm not gonna do that but it's got like this collar. It's like a silk material or whatever you want to call it. It's like that fake silk. What is it? One record, only one record today. And it's The Cure. I think this is their first album, Three Imaginary Boys. It's from 1979, so it must be their first album. But I don't have this one. I don't know which other ones I have, but I have most of their discography on vinyl. But I didn't have this one, so I grabbed this. And I got the CD, The Wedding Singer Volume 2. It's one of my favorite movies, and I have the first volume and this has a lot of good songs on it so yeah that's all i bought everybody else bought a lot of shit but i was being frugal with my money it's all about saving but tomorrow is going to be a full beach day and then we'll go out to dinner and then the beach day after that and then a beach day after that my profession is beach that is my job my job is beach so here we are just beaching is that all you have to say, Daryl? Beach time. Beach time. Since we didn't get to hit up the beach the day before, we were determined to post up at Assateague all day. And the weather was absolutely perfect. We enjoyed the sunny day, and I started my new book. For dinner, we tried a new restaurant called Saltwater 75. The food was delicious, and the Bayview seating was a nice addition. I'm not big on seafood, but my parents love their dishes. Your honest review is it? Are scallops a type of fish? Well, you would like them both. It's not fishy. Barnacles? <laughs> We had another full beach day the next day, but first I want to mention the best coffee spot in Ocean City. Every morning we make sure to grab iced coffees from Rise Up. My tip is to get there before 9 if you don't want to wait in a long line because it does get very busy. Dinner was another new place for us called Annabelle's Barbecue on Coastal Highway. The barbecue was delicious and their house-made sauces were great too. I definitely recommend the loaded grilled cheese if you visit Annabelle's. What'd you get? The brisket, some wings, barbecue wings, and then I got the loaded grilled cheese with a side of mac and cheese. After our filling dinner, we needed to do some walking, so we went down to the boardwalk. Over the years, we visited the boardwalk much less than when we first started coming to OC, 
It's great for the little ones, but for three adults, there's not a whole lot to do. But I will recommend getting Thrasher's Fries if you're on the boardwalk. The vibes are nice, but I don't think it's a must-do for me. another beach day, we cleaned up and headed over to one of our favorite restaurants in OC, Bad Monkey. We have made sure to visit Bad Monkey every year and we've never had a bad meal. There's so many options and the portions are huge. The Mex-Tex burger and Daryl has the crab cake sandwich. Show that off. Show that crab. Yum yum. In fact, we love Bad Monkey so much that the next morning we decided to finally try their breakfast. Since we were rained out, it was the perfect opportunity to try their breakfast options and it did not disappoint. The monkey bread itself was worth it, and our meals were nothing to complain about. Unfortunately, the rain didn't let up so we traveled to Snow Hill, another small town near OC. Although there isn't as many stores as there is in Berlin, my dad likes to visit Toy Town, a large antique store in the area. We used our last day as another antiquing and shopping day, so we drove out to Salisbury to look at another record store. <sighs> we still planned on going to a nice dinner when we got back to OC, but everything was booked up. Something that we usually don't have a problem with. So we gave up on finding a restaurant and settled for Arby's, which was not ideal, but we got a good laugh out of the situation. Every restaurant in Ocean City was packed, so we got Arby's for dinner. And honestly, it's it's gonna be fine. It'll still taste good, so it's cheers. Delicious. So as always, we had a great time visiting Ocean City, Maryland. It's nice that even after all these years, we can still find some new things to do and new things to check out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, make sure you like and subscribe before you leave. And I'll see you guys next time.